friends, denizens of the internet, hello and welcome back to another exciting episode of Days Gone over here at Lost Time Gaming. I am Devo, we are jumping back into the shoes of Deacon St. John, and we're going to get out of here before that guy with a gun sees me. <laughs> because I don't think they're happy to see me. I'm pretty sure those are like the ghosts of the people we've murdered last episode. <laughs> so, as usual... Uh, oh. Deacon St. John to Lost Lake Infirmary, come back. Deke! Hey, uh, feeling a lot of it, you know. You okay? What's going on? Who's <laughs> okay? Uh, nothing. I, uh, got tired of listening to the radio free organ. You know, it takes so much of this truth and bullshit, you know? Deke, uh, and Eddie told me. No, I did it. It's done, Boozer. It's done. It's over. Ah, uh, Deke. Uh, sorry, I'm feeling, feeling a little woozy. Yeah. Uh, hey, Addie's gonna kill me if she Funny. finds out you're out of bed fucking around. I love it yeah, I, I hear a bunk uh, calling my name. Lost Lake signing off. Bye. Hey, listen, Boozer. Oh. Get away from me. Bye, Boozer. I was going to say, didn't we hear that last time? But I think that got interrupted because we got close to the mission. I'm pretty sure that's what happened. And now we are back. We're going to high-five Ricky. Up top! Hit me! Oh, you want me to walk around the bike? Okay. I can't, I can't stand hey, in front of the bike. Hey, Ricky. I got him. Deacon, what a relief. Lindsay has some folks she was close to. I'll let him know. Yeah, okay. I'll see you around, Ricky. See you around indeed, Ricky. Nothing like a little bounty hunting. I mean, technically all we did was find the guy. He was he was already dead, you know? <laughs> here for your bike? Hey, I'm here for the gas. That's what I'm here for. Give me the gas. Shit. You really need a lot of fuel. Yes. Bike's looking pretty busted. You're looking pretty busted. How about that? See, it doesn't feel good when you tell somebody they're looking busted, so shut up. Oh, we can get we can get engine two, which is good, but let's see what else we can get here. An exhaust one or exhaust exhaust two, okay. Uh we don't need a salad bag, we just got one of those. We can't get a bigger gas tank, which is really like the the other thing I would have been interested in getting, and we can't get it. No new tires and no new forks. So let's uh Let's get engine two. Yeah, good part that one. Yes. Big engine make happy Deacon. I'll be okay. Here if you need me. Well, I don't, so shut up. Later, Deke. <laughs> just just being derisive for no reason. Like, so shut up. Oh, what's up, man? You got any bounties? Yes, I do. Tell yeah. all. <laughs> got some ears here, okay. That's all I got. That's the weirdest thing I've heard today. Got some ears there, okay. It, like Hello. sounding happy about hey, it. Blair, how's life? Give me yeah, the good. ammo. I good like a the ammo. Yep. And Here you suppressors. Go. I always feel bad when I go to shoot somebody I don't have a suppressor on. All right. Mostly because it just means zombies. See you around. All right, where are we going to now? Let's pull up the menu here, and we're going, we're going just right over there. I thought that was 700 meters. It turns out it was 70. So let's just foot it up this hill here. Nothing like running up a hill at full sprint. Ah, that, that'll that get you nice and warm. <laughs> and then we travel through time. Hmm, yes. Time travel. Deke? I've been, uh, thinking about what you were saying about 
doing something to make a difference around here, pay back the camp. I'm listening. Do you got a few minutes? I want to show you something. Yeah, guess I can spare you a minute or two. So where are we heading? You ever been out to the caves north of the lake? I know. Come on, see if you can keep up. Okay, let's go. Like, yeah, I mean, we're we're doing a light jog, so I'm pretty sure I'd keep up with that. Even though... Harsh duty anyway this morning. Seems like he's pulling away from freaks us. Freaks are stuck in the muck out that way. When's the last time you went up there? In a few years, I guess. When I was a boy, we used to live in that damn cave. The old man sort of fancied himself a geologist. Geologist, huh? Oh, Sounds I hear like zombies. We got a couple. Freaks stuck in the mud, I mean. Yeah, sounds like... Here, let me take care of them. All right. You gotta let you do that. Can I brain stab them? The answer is no. Okay. You want me to? You want me to plug them? I can. I can dig that. I just let me take that off. We don't need that. Nice work. I think Schizo's just found a new man for the job. Ugh. You know what Schizo can go do. Anyway, as I was saying. We spent hours talking about how all these caves were formed when lava flows would harden on the outside, but the molten cores would still flow like buried rivers. You got the big caves that drew in the tourists, like Metolius up there. There's way more than that. Riddled all over these parts. Let's say, oh, that's a horde okay, up there. Okay, we're coming up on the highway. We gotta be quiet. That's a big old mass of zombies up there. Oh, and they're angry. All right, get Jesus Christ! This is why you brought me out of here? You smell a bunch of goddamn freaks? Yeah. Okay, okay. Come on, follow him. Wait, wait, wait. Follow him? Where the hell are we going? You'll see. Come on. Don't get too close. Stay down. Oh, that is a... That is a big old line of zombies walking up that hill there. What the hell are we doing, Deke? This doesn't seem all that smart, even for a goddamn drifter. Hold up, hold up. You remember telling me about how the tourists used to flood up from California in the summer, choke off Highway 97 and the I-5 freeway? Yeah, in July, folks smelled almost as bad as these here freaks. Well, you weren't wrong about one thing. These freaks, the big groups, the ones that some call hordes, I think they're the reason we can't get their numbers down. What do you mean? Think about it, man. I've been out here in the shit collecting bounties for more than a year. Who's or two? Ricky, Schizo, a few others. How many freaks do you think I killed? A few. A few. Yeah, but their numbers never go down. You got a point? It's these hordes. Every night, there's a steady stream of them up and down the Sandium Highway. Thousands of freaks pouring into the Lost Lake Valley north of the Cascades. And you think they're coming up from California? Highway's closed off. No one's been south of the Santium Pass in years. It's not closed off to the hordes. Freaks are the reason it's closed off. Anyway, the point I'm trying to make is that the hordes come in every night. Not a goddamn thing we can do to stop them. That's a lot of zombies. <laughs> that, is a, that is an unsettling amount of zombies. Also, yeah, Mike, I think I think you're uh, you that you're next. Much right. Lost more than a few men trying to back in the day. Yeah, I know. I was there. And every horde that comes through leaves a few stragglers or gets busted up and scatters and, and just like that, freaks everywhere as far as the eye can see. <clears throat> I can't even imagine how many are in this pass. We figure out a way to stop the hordes coming through, maybe we can make some headway, reduce their numbers. Make it safer. Free up more farmland, irrigation. Yeah. Okay, so how do we do that? You know goddamn well you can't take on a, a, a whatever you call it, a, a horde? Well, we were really close to him there. This is how. Oh, God damn. Yeah. They stay in there all day, hibernating or whatever the hell freaks do. So, what are you thinking that we... Yep. Blow it the hell up. 
Stick a dynamite there, there, and there. We'll bring down a mountain of rock. We seal this shit up. Yeah, so we trap a few hundred inside. What good is that gonna no, do? No, no, you don't get it. We seal this cave. Maybe they don't got no place to sleep. Or maybe this trail of piss and shit dries out, goes stale, and others stop coming. Yeah. All right. All right. You get my attention. Okay, come on, let's head back. All right, seems like we got ourselves a plan in the All works. Right. My knees are warmed up a bit. Let's see if you can keep up. Yeah, okay. Tell me, when does being out in the shit make you an expert on freaks? You spend your spare time just following them around, seeing what makes them tick? Not exactly. I mean... And how do you know about all this? About what a horde's gonna do, where they sleep? A few days ago, I was riding north of Belknap Crater when a chopper flew by. A chopper? What the hell? Just listen to me. It was a black chopper. One of those Nero choppers that used to fly all over the goddamn place when the shit was going down. And you saw one? Still flying? I followed him. I stole one of their radios. I've been trying to track him down, see if they have a base around here. Supplies. Shit, I mean, see if the feds are still alive. You know what I'm saying? They're out here doing field work of some kind on the freaks. They're studying them. They got resources to do that while we're out here starving, fighting to stay alive. I followed them up to the grotto caves. You know the ones? Yeah. They had motion sensors set up, measuring how many freaks used the cave during the day. And, uh, Mike, it was thousands. That right. They said freaks all up and down the Cascade Range, south of Crater Lake and north up to Smith Rock, all used these lava tube caves to hibernate. So, we blew up those caves. Maybe we have a few less to deal with. Less zombies equals good. Oh, we're, we're done talking now? Okay. <laughs> I wasn't sure. <laughs> hey, this idea of yours, it's got some merit, but job like that it's gonna take a fair amount of TNT he said you wanted help making Lost Lake safer this is how we do it <sighs> all right all right look there's some things I got to do okay but you meet me at the bridge in a couple of minutes I know where we can find some Not like a little uh, explosive. Oh, <laughs> I was gonna say, hold up, you don't get to talk, cause it's mission complete o'clock. <laughs> All right. You were supposed to be up at the farm an hour ago. My guy said he's got a shovel waiting for you. Yeah, Schizo, about that, I'm busy. See, Iron Mike and I, we're just heading out on a run. You and Iron Mike, you'll get your ass up that way today. Or you and your gimp boyfriend are gonna find yourselves out in the shit. You hear me? Without a goddamn battle. Yeah, yeah, I'll get right on that. Saint John out. Oh, Schizo, I am just eagerly anticipating the future. Just you wait, buddy. Last time I was on the road, and it will be the last Oh, yeah, time. I guess I can run now. I, I still can't reload my pistol for whatever reason. They don't want me doing that in town. Which I guess makes a certain kind of sense. But there's a lot of people carrying like rifles and stuff out here. What is, what's me reloading my pistol gonna do? All right, but oh, why is our bike not here now? What? Why, why is it over there? Did I just see it and ignore it? Because I've done that. No, here it is. Parked in the parking spot. I guess you just kind of ignore that when uh, society has died. I'm just to make sure. So we're just going right there, and we've got nothing else going on. Except working for Tucker, but who cares about that? What's this, though? Wait, I have to come back up here? Oh. Well, let's do that. So we can... I say, let's do that before we, we do another mission, like another main story mission. And we'll kind of take out these, well, I guess this uh, 
infestation place on the way so we can fast travel back and this one i guess so yeah let's do that unless it's gonna force us to do this oh that's right it is gonna force us we're going right with iron mike this is not a do later kind of thing ready where are we headed this time you're gonna have to trust me okay where are we going you know what they used to mine all around these parts yeah uh mercury or something that's right cinnabar they extracted mercury from cinnabar Folks back east think it was gold mines out here and silver. Not so. Back in the early 1900s, cinnabar was worth more than gold. To operate the mine, you need TNT for expansion, blowing out new tunnels, clearing cave-ins, that sort of shit. And to own TNT, you had to register with the county, keep copies of the keys to all your lockboxes with the commissioner. Wait, the county courthouse? Where the hell is that? Thought you knew. It's in the old federal building. The old federal building. The one in Sherman's camp. Jesus, Mike. What the hell? You told me... You, you told me that you were never setting foot in that place again. Did I? I don't recall. You were drunk right after Joe was killed. Did I tell you why? No. Here. Turn right here. This is it. Mike, the place is going to be crawling. I don't, I don't think this is a good idea. Uh, weather holds will be safe enough. All right. That there? It's the old federal building. That's where we're headed. Just ignore the zombie children. <laughs> Just ignore There's them. Actually, hold on. Trouble. Stay out of the buildings. Uh, got to reload. we got to head over this way. Where are we headed? Just follow me. He'll be on the commissioner. And and you know where he is? <laughs> where his body is? Yeah, I think I do. We're just gonna, just gonna coast by back. them zombies. Yeah, everybody got wiped out, man, woman, and child. Only a few got out, and, and uh, you, you were one of them, right? Only two got out. Me and Nora. But it wasn't the freaks that took us out. What do you mean? Here. Not the freaks, you say. left after all and well, they... oh hell you can see what they did like I said two people walked out of this town after all was said and done and some days the hell one of them wasn't me commissioner's over there in the bean counter suit go get the key so we can get the hell out of here well that explains why you knew where the commissioner was I guess and wow that is you didn't give a damn about sealing the caves you brought me here be you, you brought me here because you wanted me to see this. Not true. All right, you got the key. We're going to go get the maps to those mines, just like I said, and we're going to get more than enough TNT to seal every cave in the valley. Bullshit. You are right about one thing. I'm not sorry you've seen it. Not following you, Mike. I am talking about the war that's coming. With the Rippers. The one that Schizo saw. Oh, you 
cares how many die on either side. Never mind. Come on, let's get this done. Here's the door. Place oh. is locked up tight. Not anymore. <laughs> Come on. I gotta find a way upstairs. Smells like something died in here. Newts. Yeah, I smell them. Bad business. Never much like kids. They always tended to get on my nerves. It was always the sore spot between me and my Elizabeth. God rest her soul. And... I didn't like kids. Wow, well, here I thought you liked everyone. What's behind door okay. number three? All right, this is it. Now we got maps to every mine in the county showing where they stored their dynamite. Okay, come on. And that's not good. Yeah. Were you expecting anyone? Nope. Do you have my back here? Hey, I don't like starting trouble, but I'll finish it if I have to. Sounds good to me, boss. Let's go, uh, let's go do what's got to be done. Stay behind me. Hey, I could take care of myself. I'm not saying you can't, but remember the last time you were on the ship. Yeah, like I said, I'm staying behind you. Alright, well, there goes stealth. Stealth is out the window now. Alright. That's all of them. Let's go. Oh, that's all home? Well, that was easy. Pop a little reload there. And... Well, they're shooting zombies. We're fine. We're good. They're bringing the whole goddamn town down on us. Oh, yeah, this is not good. <laughs> All right, you know what? Oh, you lucky, you piece of crap. Stay down. There we go. I got this. That's how it's done. Iron Mike, I, I, I want to go on record as saying, I don't think you got this. There we go. I don't have any reasoning to back that up, but I'm gonna I'm gonna stick with my guns on this one. Oh come on! There we go. I'm. Oh hey, how are you? Okay, you wanna? You guys wanna play? We can play. I'm fine with that. Come on. I did. Who else wants to play? Anyone? Just a heads up, I'm playing for keeps. No? Okay. Mike, what's going on? Why are you hanging back here? There's somebody I forgot to shoot. Oh, yeah, this guy. Yeah, not anymore. That zombie was like, aww. <laughs> Alright, Mike, what what are we doing? We moving? There we go. Little assist. Oh yeah, I'm right behind you. Okay, we should probably uh Ah, the fellow chucker, eh? Dang, that didn't work. Hey, 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 hey. None of that now. Ow, what the heck was that? Iron Mike's dead, oh no. <laughs> Why? Why did all of a sudden we get like ambushed from the rear? That's that's not good. I don't think that's how that's supposed to go. I'm gonna go this way and do this au natural. Oh, that tickled a little bit. Yep, just keep my eyes on me here. I don't care for you person on the roof of that gas station. I really don't. So much so, I'm gonna go take care of you right now. Action roll! Alright, let's see what you got. You 
That's all I needed. Just one to get you to stop aiming at me. Oh, ow, okay. I thought I was on the other side of that wall. I was not, apparently. There you go, now you're dead. All right, let's try this. There you go, now you're dead, cheap piece of crap. Jesus, what a mess. Now you know why no one goes into Sherman's camp. Eddie finds out you're out here risking your ass like this, she's gonna be pissed. Now how would she find out about something like that? Not from me. I guess we're good. we're just gonna GDFO now. Let us leave. After you, Mike. There we go. It's raining pretty good out here. <laughs> I like how the game doesn't slow down for this. So about but... <laughs> the rippers? Why you wanted me to see that shit? No, Dick. I always saw a bit of myself in you back in the day. How's that? You don't give a shit. Oh, you care about your friend. Don't want to see him die, but me? Any other goddamn person on the planet? I don't think so. Caring will just get you killed. Yeah, that's right. Thing is, not caring will get you killed just as easy. The good folks of Sherman Camp did will stop caring about anyone but themselves and their own. Easy to kill a man when he's just some piece of meat standing between you and what you need. Schizo wants to kill Rippers, because he don't think they're human anymore. They don't count. He's standing in the way of what he wants. Well, I don't buy into that shit. I won't have I mean, Mike, have you seen the Rippers? They're, they're definitely killers, like... You know, Schizo, he, uh... He wonders why I'm a pacifist. That's, you know, that's what he likes to call me. He, uh, he thinks I'm gonna get everybody killed. Well, are you, Mike? Are you gonna get everyone killed? Freaks aren't gonna be around forever. Now, when they're gone, we're gonna need some folks around here to help pick up the pieces. Hey, look, hey, hey. I don't like Carlos and his rippers any more than I like Tucker or, or, or Copeland and his, his, his goddamn truthers. All right, but here, look. Here's the thing, Dick. I'm not going out of my way to kill any of them. I've had my share of killing. Even if Carlos comes for you, My truce will hold. You can bet on that. Yeah, Deacon don't look like he's too sure about that. <laughs> well, that was a lovely foray back into the town that we were at briefly there. And it went much worse than last time, actually. <laughs> Sweet. Doing a little good that we can. Not a whole lot, but it is something. Ooh, attractors. New mission unlock. What? Okay, so that's all the time I have for this episode today. Thank you, everybody, so much for joining me. Another exciting look into the world of Days Gone. I am Devo at Lost Time Gaming. If you enjoyed the video today, feel free to leave a like, leave a comment, and get subscribed. Let me know down in the comment section below what you thought about my gameplay, my commentary. Or anything else in general. That being said, thanks for watching. Yeah, Mike, I ain't gonna bet on that. Your truce ain't gonna hold. And as usual. Yeah, for once I agree with Schizo. The Rippers, they ain't human. Not anymore. I'll catch you all on the flip side.